Good evening, YouTube. It's your main man, Johnny J, with yet another front side post beer review. This is the Veteran Series. Uh, we just recently had Veterans Day, and I'd like to give a shout out to all the men and women who continue to do great things in this country and uh, serve the great nation of America. And uh, right now, I'm wearing uh, one of my favorite veterans jackets. Uh, my main man, Pat Droppelman, in Chicago, who served in the United States Army. I'm wearing his. Uh, Army jacket, Droppelman, as you can see, from Illinois, you know what I'm saying, bam, um, <clears throat> this is a, this is going to be a great one tonight, this is going to be the first, uh, actually no, this is going to be the second domestic beer review from Front Sight Post, uh, as I typically say, and I can't say it enough, Shout out to my main man, Steve. He didn't even have to give me this beer. I mean, this was based on a suggestion that he had a while back about a good local brew to do. We're going to start getting into some local brews. We started with the uh, Boudoir, the Czech beer. That's not necessarily local to Belgium, but um, we're going to get into Lef. Um, yeah, I almost gave it away. I was going to Lef and... Jupiler. Bam. Jupiler in a can. The first time this has ever been done on front side post, we got the can action. This looks ridiculous from this angle. 50 CLs. That's a big beer. That's about two beers in one can. So this is weighing in at 5.2 on the ABVs. And this is a blonde beer from Belgium. This is a lager. This is your Bud Light of Belgium. So this is a regular working man's hard day at work you go get a can of jupiler you hang out you kick it you complain about the job you go back and you do it all over again bam this is the everyday beer as my landlord said in belgium he said this is the everyday beer it's not a special beer it's not a craft brew this is a lager i do repeat jupiler is the lager of lagers uh weighing in at 5.2 so in America, Sam Adams, which is kind of on the nicer side of the lager scenes, 4.8 typically. Your Bud Light, I don't know, 3 point something, some, something, something real crappy. This is 5.2. So I've had this beer many a times. I'm excited to review it. I can't believe I'm finally getting around to it. Whew. Here we go. In the beeper's glass. The first time a can has ever been opened on front side post. Boom. There is no smoke on, on the on the on the opening. There's no smoke on the can on the opening. That's not happening. However, oh that nose. Yeah, it's a lager nose. It's 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 just regular corn, lots and lots of that cereal in a can, just non-threatening, heart of the hops vibe. Okay, just regular. Okay, here I go into the Beatles glass, good straight on glass. Tilt my pour a little bit. Oh, I'm going for it. Almost overdid it. Got a little bit left in the can there. I was going for 100%. This beer is golden. Um, it is a one finger head. It is dissipating extremely quickly. This is going to look like apple juice by the time I get to it. I've always said to people that I always smell a little bit of a berry. It's like a really weird fruity, maybe it's just candy sugar, but it's got a tutti fruity element to it. It's very interesting, but it is just corn syrup. Extremely hoppy. We'll dive into this one. Jupiter, front side post.
Sorry that took so long. It's just underwhelming. But it is a good beer. Like, if I had the choice between a Jupiler and a Bud Light, I'd go the route of Jupiler. It's regular. It's crisp. Um, it is a little bit complex on just the palate because it does give, give you that pucker factor. Maybe because it's cheap, it's not a craft. But, hey, it's straight up and down. Nothing crazy like the Boudoir. Nothing intense. Regular flavors or regular style. Uh, dive into this one again. Drinks like a champ. That's two gulps. Just about done. I'm going to finish it off. And I'm going to swill it in a can. Because that's how I get down. What? Didn't see that coming at all. That produced a legit one finger head. Once again, you know, I'm not going to lie to you. It's not my favorite, but it's a beer that I will get down with if it's around. So a couple, couple of uh, jupes. If the jupe is flowing, you know, then I'll be going. That's just it. Cheers. crisp and refreshing once again this is a uh, front side post beer re review and I give a shout out to my main man Steve I appreciate it um, once again Jupiler in the 50 CL can what keep it right keep it tight keep it chill and I will see you tomorrow night. And also, thank your veterans. Peace.